Alright guys, we're back with Car Sharks on the Rodney1279 channel. Alex Panta has won his first game in $500. But Brandy, you know what you have to do? You have to win this game in order to stick around, okay? Yes. But Brandy, this is your question. Brandon, we found 100 people across the country who live in towns with populations of 10,000 or less. And ask them, did you marry someone you want to, this, this is wrong. It says, did you marry someone you went to high school with? That's what it says. How many did end up marrying their high school sweetheart? Going with 45, okay. Alex, higher or lower than 45? Uh, uh, ooh, that's a tricky one, just like Brandon said. I think that is a little bit higher. A little higher, okay. Okay, let's check it out. The actual number of, um, Let's see, what does it say? The actual number of people across the country who said that they ended up marrying their high school sweetheart is... It's 19. It's not higher, it's lower. Brandon, you get it. All right, Brandon, let's see your card. Brandon, your card is a 7. Change it. All right. The 7 becomes a 2, a better change. Oh, yeah. Come on. No doubles. Higher. Higher than two. It's a four. Higher. Higher than a four. It's a nine. Um, freeze. Freezing on the nine, keeping Alex away from his cards. And we go to another high level question. And it's your question, Alex. All right. Uh. Alex, our man on the street went to Nashville, Tennessee, where he asked one of the people, do you believe hell literally exists? H-E-L-L. -L. How many people in Nashville believe hell literally exists? Mm -hmm. I think that's a low number. I think that will, no, wait, high number. Uh, 60, I'm gonna say 60, 60, zero. He's going with 60. Brandon, how low than 60? Lower than 60. Okay, let's check it out. The actual number of people in Nashville that said that they believe that hell exists is... Is 82. Is not lower, is higher. Alright, Alex, you get to play your cards now. Let's see what your opening card is. Hopefully it's an or a two. Well, it's a, a little bit good. It's a king. Uh, Mark, where do you think I should go? High or low? Uh, lower than the king, for sure. Low, lower than the king, yeah. Lower than the king. It's a double. I'm sorry, Alex. What? Fourth double of the game. Yeah, we got a lot of doubles. Okay, Brandon, you got a free chance. You have to play off the nine. Okay, I'll go lower. Lower than the nine. No, it's a 10. And I'm going to put these cards you said on here. And I'm going to have to decline the call because we're in the middle of the game here. And uh, Brandon, here's your question. Brandon, we asked 100 sanitation workers, have you ever found money in someone's trash? How many sanitation workers said they have found money? Um, I'm going to say a 40. You said 40, 40? Yes, 40. Okay, 40. All right, um, Alex, is it higher or lower than 40? Hey, Mark, where do you think I should go? Higher or lower? Forty. Brandon said forty. Yeah. Oh, forty. Okay, go higher. Okay, higher. Higher than forty. Okay, let's check it out. 
I am. The actual number of sanitation workers that said they have found money in someone's trash is. It is 54. It is higher. Good job, Alex. Okay. Alright. Alex, you have the king. What do you want to do? A king. Uh, Mark, what do you think I should declare or change it? Uh, go lower than the king. Lower. Lower than the king. It's a three. Higher. Higher than a three. It's a seven. Uh, what, where do you think I should go, Mark? I say that you should freeze. Freeze. Uh, you're freezing. Both players have three cards turned over, and we had another step, sudden death question. Again, somebody must win on this play of the cards, so control is critical. Alex, this is your question. Alex, we asked 100 women who have a teenage son, have you ever looked at your son and asked yourself, where did I go wrong? How many women said they have? Well, Alex, you should make this your call for yourself. Like, when some people can say, no offense. Um, uh, I think it'd be 48. Going with 48. Brandon, is it higher or lower than 48? Um, I'm going to say that's higher. Going higher, okay. This is an important decision. Let's check it out. The actual number of women who said to their sons, where did I go wrong, is... It is 49. You got it, Brandon. It is one higher only. So out you was very close on that one. But, Brandon, you get it. Now, here's the situation, Brandon. You have a base card of a nine showing. You have the power to change that nine if you want to. And you have two cards to go. Or you can pass uh, the control to um, Alex. He has a seven showing. He also has two cards to go, but he does not have the power to change it. What's your decision? Do you want to play it yourself or pass it? It's really a double-edged play, but I'm going to go for it, and I'm going to change my card. All right, he's going on. One mistake, and Alex is the champion. All right. The nine becomes a jack. Call it. Lower. Lower than a jack. It's a joker! Oh. <laughs> Alright, so you got it's a thousand dollar bonus, but you must win the match in order to claim your joker. Now, do you want to make the same decision, Brandon? Yes. Yeah. Go lower. Lower than a jack. No, it's a queen! We have a new champion! The money costs for thirty-two thousand dollars in just one moment. Well, Brandon, um, you played a good game. You had a lot of bad cards there, but you're taking home sixteen thousand dollars in our congratulations. Okay? Yes, I will. And when we come back, Alex Panther will play go at the money cards again for thirty-two thousand dollars. Stay tuned. <laughs> 